Alrighty, logo's fixed in the chat. There we go. We are ready for this match. Got Greasy Dream once again against the killing feature of the enemy team Squid by Finks. Both of them, both of these players are really, really good Squid pilots. So I'm looking forward to that. I don't really care about Pyramidians. Like at all. That's just me. Tuna of Space. I've never heard the name before, but I like it. He has around a while. Just about all of these guys have been around for a fairly decent amount of time. Yeah, all there's level 45. There's a couple of series that I'm not fully familiar with, but just about that. There's a fairly experienced lobby. Yeah, I believe these two teams keep going head to head in the Sunday Community Skirmish as well. From what I've heard. I believe you would be correct, though, to be completely honest, I am not fully caught up on. Send a community skirmish, and shame on me for that. Storm Riders fully readied up. Yeah, they are good to go. Looks like Team Predator is doing their last minute, you know, pep talk, getting ready for this big match. Uh, both these teams haven't lost yet, so whoever does lose gets to, you know, go back to the Redemption Bracket, try again if they do fail. Uh, whoever wins will go into the finals, though, so kudos to them. Yes, this is the semifinals. Of the winner's bracket, I suppose. Team Predators just crossing their T's, dotting their I's, making sure all their shoelaces are nicely tied tight. God forbid you step on a shoelace trying to run around on one of these ships. That would not end well. You trip, you fall, you break air extinguisher, fluid goes everywhere, big problem. Oh man, only a minute left. Will they ready up in time? Find out next week. I'm sure they will. Next week? Yeah, Maybe that's right, next now. week. No, no, this is a... Same friend. Icarus time, same Icarus channel? That's right. It's one of those cliffhanger things that we show up. Do you have a little graphic for, like, a book sort of next time thing? No, I can make one, though. I'll make one during the match. Just have the camera just sit there staring at a mountain. That'll be great. I'm sure everyone will join that. On the bright side, it looks like the Blood and Brass is going along really well so far. You know, we're getting to our matches very fast, getting things done you know, quite on time here. Only an hour in. It'll be done pretty soon, actually, this first week here. I believe this first week is going to go a lot quicker than the following week. But yes, everything is going very much according to plan. Uh, thank you to all of their organizers, masters, and the referees, and everyone participating for being on time and showing up, and etc, etc, etc. And we are getting into a match, and I'll repeat that at the end of the day's sessions anyways, but yes. Clash at Black Cliff. The new 2v2 map, which I have not flown on competitively. I've been on here in some public matches, and it's pretty fun. A lot of circling the mountain, of course. That's, that's what happens. Anyway, the up refinery. first... Yep. Up first, we have Greasy Dream here, piloted by Mighty Cub. See here, it's a Gatling Banshee, once again, with a cairn on the back. Good ship, love it, fly it myself. Next up, we have the Arya Sunstar, piloted by Incio. It is a Gatling Mortar up front, so a Metamidian with a Banshee on the side and a Mine Launcher. No, Gatling on the back, that's odd. Gatling Banshee on the side? What's more is it's a reverse Metamidian. So someone's clearly listening to those blow out of frawls tips. Uh, on the blue team, Storm Riders, we have Chariot, a Pyramidian, being flown by Dementio. 
Uh, it has a forward-facing Hades and Arta, uh, excuse me, forward-facing Hades and Mercury field gun with a starboard Banshee carronade. So he definitely plans on using that should the case rise. And then the killing feature being floated by Finks. It's a Artemis Gatling gun squid with a rever the rear flag. So he is definitely looking to be more of a support role than uh, Greasy Dream is. Speaking of Greasy Dream, two squids going at it right away. Oh man, here we go. Two kill squids going at it. I, I definitely want to vote for uh, Greasy Dream in the squid fight. I think I like uh, Dementio's Pyramidian more though. That that uh, that field gun of Hades seems odd, but I think it'll work out. That was regardless. He's I don't... well. That was odd. I apologize for that. Anyway, I am back in here. Apologize for that, some connection issues. What a mess, Jub Jub. Jub Jub. Alright, Jub Jub is dead to us, I guess. Apologize for the little disconnection there. On the bright side, I am recording, so you can see... Well, now I guess everything I saw, so everything you saw on the Twitch could be the same. Never mind. Oh, Chariot getting hammered here by Greasy Dream. Killing feature has some damage on him already. Uh, Jub Jub is telling me he's talking. I can't seem to hear him. That's odd. Rejoin that chat there, see if that fixes things. Lots of technical issues. Something had to break today. Nothing ever goes right. Hello, I'm back, Jub Jub. Hello? Jub Jub is back. Alright, things are working again. Problem solved. Apologies for the technical issues and hiccups. Uh, we have Killing Feature absolutely destroying Arya Sunstar here. Yes. And Greasy Dream sort of peppering Chariot. Yeah, these squids are definitely winning against these Pyramidians. Yeah, Chariot trying to brave some, uh, some support fire here against the Sunstar. I'll definitely say in a personal opinion. Oh, Chariot going down to Greasy Dream. Oh, oh! Not quite! A single banshee missed, and that's like they—they they, all they needed was one more, and they could have had it. They didn't get quite get Hunter it. Done moved with the aiming. Oh yeah, Sunstar way too far. It's it's two v one now on Greasy Dream here. He is gonna get shredded by these ships. Chariot using his port side close range. Killing feature is gonna try and use his must pin him down. Yeah, Sunstar is coming back in, Greasy but he's Dream way too late. Anywhere quick. Sunstar needs to get out of there. He's not going to make it in time. If I was Unless, Sunstar, I would go after Chariot right now, who is sitting there. If he can, if he can kill this squid, he'll have a definite advantage. I think he just. If he can take out the squid. Nope, not quite. No, he's changing targets now. He's going for Chariot. Jump up, giving him tips. I have not said anything to them. It's a lot of disables, though. Got an Artemis, got the Gatling going, got the field gun. It's gonna be really hard to actually take this ship out. Yep, Chariot's there it goes. Full health now. So I believe if that's If he was to go Chariot, he should have done that at the start of the engagement and sort of sacrificed uh, his squid. Currently, it's zero to two in favor of Stormrider. Yeah, so very, two. very close match there. Both, both the blue ships here are still pretty injured, especially Chariot. Who well, hopefully he won't try and kill himself to reset, which I don't think he is. No, he's not. Alright, we're watching you. 
We will if wag we our fingers himself, if you do that. I'm pretty sure it would still give the kill to red team. I think I think if it's been long enough since you've been hit, it won't count. I'm not sure. Don't don't cheat the game, people. Yeah, either way, don't be one of those people. Oh, Greasy Dream is about to be in a 2v1. He is so far ahead of Sunstar. He's Why, on the other side of the map. Wow, he is really far. Almost he is noping his way out of here. He's gonna try his best. It's gonna be really hard against the uh, the Artemis field guns, though. What is Sunstar? He needs to get in here. He's so far. Push it. I think Greasy Dreams. Uh, he's still trying to run here. Gonna try to slip through the uh, mountain. I'm not sure to what avail, though. He might. Yeah, he's gonna make it around the mountain. It'll buy him a little bit of time, but that's gonna leave Sunstar all by himself. If Stormrider tries to follow Greasy Dream through, and they don't do anything about Sunstar, which they will, because he's spotted now. He's uh, still so far, though. Gonna... They have plenty of time to take down Greasy Dream. Yeah, and that's exactly what they're gonna do. They are just rushing forward. Yeah, Sunstar is going to have a really hard time catching up now, because they're on the opposite side of the mountain again. Greasy Dream's going to circle around. If Sunstar can sort of fit through this gap, he might have a very good flank on Chariot. Oh, we did it! Logicalian Incio getting plus ten arbitrary points that don't mean anything for flying through tight corners today. Gap Mortar going out on killing feature. Not sure it's gonna do much though. I'm surprised his armor didn't go down there. Oh, there it goes from Mortars finally. Chariot and Greasy Dream going at it. Greasy Dream getting Greasy. hammered. He, yeah, he's not doing good in that engagement. Let's go take a peek over here before this ends. Chariot trying to bully this little squid down. I think the squid's gonna be okay gonna slip now. Under him. Is he gonna go help out his ally? Uh, I think that's I think where he's so. heading. It's gonna be hard to do against that Pyramidian though. She probably should have finished him off. Yeah, because those are long range guns and they're very disabling and they hit really hard, especially against the squid. Sunstar and Killing Feature going at it here. I think Killing Feature's not in a great spot, but he has plenty of disables. So as long as they can keep breaking those guns, Sunstar's gonna have a hard t just a just a bad day. Grace Dream's back around, it's 2v1. Squid's gonna run away. That's gonna give Chariot some shots once they pop out of the cover here. No, they're Sunstar not turning to Chariot. Oh, Which, some... yeah, I don't know if that's a wise choice. Yeah, he should have stayed behind cover a little bit longer there. It's okay it though, it's hard like to know. Team Predators are splitting up. A greasy Dream is going to try to stay on that squid to keep him off his ally. Killing I think if, lobbing Artemis at if he can break that squid armor, he can definitely kill him with the Banshee here. Do it, do it. You uh, broke it. She's there it goes. Out. Oh, couple hits, not quite enough. They got that armor up really fast there. Oh, and blocked by terrain too. Let's go Aria over Sunstar here. Is not looking good. Yeah, the definitely not. Down as he rams it. He's not going to make it. There he goes. Three and zero for the Riders. Now Greasy Dream is left in the same goal that he started in. Yeah, I think I think the uh, Team Predators really needs to focus down the Chariot. Once he's gone, the killing feature shouldn't be that difficult to kill. He's a squid, so it'll still be a pain in the butt, but... Yeah, he has a... You're right, it won't be as... Bad. He has a side gatling, so he's not as, I guess, armor strippy. Looks like they're more focused focused on the disables. And then of course they want to pair up with that that back flat gun, I believe, with the chariot for the long range kills. Yeah, Grease Dream running back to his ally here, doing a good job of staying alive. Squids are really hard to kill when they want to stay alive. We're at the ten minute mark right now. Halfway done with this match. 
Sunstar is so far spotted. It's been very action intense. Greasy Dream needs to start pushing in here. Sunstar, there we go. He took a really long time for him to start shooting. And as soon as he does, though, he disabled that Gatling gun. He's gonna have just a bad day. Definitely. Yeah, Sunstar getting Crazy absolutely Dream's hammered. Chariot. Oh, armor or down no, on killing feature. Some benches going out, lots of misses. Oh! Sunstar, killing Chariot! Chariot went down, they didn't keep that get more disabled hydro enough. Mortar. Excellent, excellent, excellent play by the Sunstar there, that was very nice. So, Which three to one. Which killing feature to noped. Yeah, Squid has noped his way out of there. They're not going to chase him too hard, I believe. Uh, looks like Predators might be splitting up again. Sunstar going down the middle, Grease Dream going around the outside. I'm not sure if they should do that. If Sunstar is left alone, he's just going to just gonna get destroyed by the killing feature here. Chariot spawning in right next to killing feature. And as Sunstar is moving in, straight into the front guns of Chariot. Yeah, Chariot here getting the flank on Sunstar. Greasy Dream He is really instantly regretting it. Yeah, Greasy Dream way too far again. They're, they they want to flank, but their timing is just just really off. Yeah, Sunstar's gonna Sunstar's get wrecked here. He's gonna, be, he's gonna be rammed. Destroyed. Insta Gib. Ram. Oh, not an Insta Gib. He's alright. Killing he's feature's finally here, but it's finery. too late. Yeah, Greasy Dream. Greasy Dream is finally here, but he's he's way too late to help his ally out. It's now four to one in favor of Riders. I I don't think they can Team Brother can turn this around. I've seen crazier. Definitely agree that Smart Money is currently on Storm Riders right now. Yeah, two v one against Greasy Dream. He's gonna back away again, try to stay alive. Sunstar has spawned back in, but again, they're really, really far away. Yeah, they seem to keep fighting. I guess near Blue Spawn, it looks like. Greasy Dream is saying pincer moved here. Yeah, now here's here's how you do a flank. Guns. This is a fairly small pincer, though. I wouldn't really say it's a flank flank. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not much, but you know, they, they did get the timing pretty well. They both showed up right around the same time. They're having a hard time pinning down the squid, though, as, as you do. Oh, armor goes down. This could be it for him. Nope, just barely staying alive. Up and down. Not for much longer. Oh, Gatling gun. Get him. Sunstar's finally in, but I think he's just a little too late. Oh, Killing Feature's backing off. Looks like we're going to focus on the Pyramidian here. More than the kill. Ow. I'm pretty sure Chariot killed Greasy Dream right at the end. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. A very good game to both. No, teams. no, Greasy Dream bumped into something. Oh no! That yeah, happened? that's what happened. Well, he's ignoring my Internet little replay is here. Chewing gum. There's another fun fact. Really good match, though. Let's see what we have up next here. I believe the next match is going to be hosted on Guns of Icarus 2, and it is going to be uh, match K, which is going to be the loser of this match against the winners of J, who is going to be... I'm not sure. Yeah, I believe they're doing uh, Muse of Stories vs. Cakewatch right now, and that should be over pretty soon. Looks like Bards did get the first kill, of course. Uh, once that's over, they'll be moving into K. So to anyone not aware, 